uh, the latest vlog with Big Oggy. So I thought I'd take the opportunity just to make a, a bit of behind the scenes video, just to show you what goes on with making the video. So uh, this would have started ooh, a couple weeks ago with Big Oggy trying to arrange the course to go and film. Um, luckily for me, we're filming at Yelverton, which is just across the border in Devon, so not far for me to go. Obviously, Big Oggy and Neil coming down from uh, the other end of Cornwall. Uh, John would have no doubt uh, been charging all of these batteries for the cameras last night. So I'm ready for the filming today. So I'm actually on my way to pick up Darren, the, the Sturminator, uh, in Plymouth, and then go on to Yelverton. Should be on now so i've just picked up darren hello so on our way to yelverton now yeah. so you've been a member here you I were saying year. darren so yeah i spent uh, a good year there so tough course we've discussed already it's going to be a challenging day. yes especially with this wind because it's it's quite yeah. open up there as well and you said don't want to go in the uh gorse bushes no. because of the the snakes Adders. yes i've seen many other adder up there when, when i was a member but now it's coming into autumn. I think they might hibernate, or they might sort of go yeah. down to. With it being colder, they might. Yeah, they might. Might not be, not be so, so active. No, no. But uh, hopefully, we don't need an adder for our score. No. <laughs> <laughs> boom, boom. Afternoon, John. Afternoon. Afternoon, Afternoon Neil. You come across on Dartmoor. Hello, Hello everybody. Hello. Welcome to the behind the scenes. Behind the scenes. Why well, boggles? We are, we're currently looking at um, New another Lombardy putter. We've got to do a little review of it at some point. Nice. So. Oh, what's this? Uh, it's a new putter from Lombardy from our friends in America. Oh, Still wow. got the wrapper on it. Still got the wrapper on it, mate. It's called a Pisa, I believe. Oh, very nice. Should have a good lean on it, hopefully. Going to give it a try, are we? Should we give it a try? We're just discussing what we're going to do with it. Okay. Yeah. That's not from John's closet, is it? No, no, not, <laughs> not, not from... He's got <laughs> loads, hasn't he? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But yeah, Darren's just been telling me it's a, a tight course. Hang on, hey, you're talking to us, sorry. There you go. He doesn't put the camera in the right place, does he? Yes, Darren's been telling us it's a tight course. Uh, yeah. Neil and I have watched all of Dan Hendrickson's videos from yeah. right, years Jan. ago. Six parts. Yeah, we, we're, we're briefed on it. Yeah, we're briefed on the place. Oh. 200 yard first uh yes. first yeah, yeah, just seen that. Three, yeah. Lovely. Right, the other side of the road the sheep are right good. by the first the sheep have you yeah i came here two hours earlier mate I mean, sheep photography again look see <laughs> i know <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so if you're not well so you're yeah so you're <laughs> gonna do a behind the scenes just behind today, the scenes yes oh, yeah, so. thank you very much mate so although steve is going to be doing a uh, behind the scenes footage today for a video uh, they've all gone to the loo I've been here two hours doing some bits of B-roll and stuff. Hi everybody, welcome to another Cornish Quest. Yes, I am back playing golf and filming with some of the lads. Today I'm with Neil Allen, I'm with Steve Treby and a specialist for this course, Darren Sturman. Yes, the Sturminator is back on the channel probably I think for the first time this year. Um, we're calling a specialist because we are at Yelverton. We are at a fantastic course beautiful moorland course one of the best that i know and darren used to be a member here so it's going to be interesting hopefully it's going to be a lot of fun too see you on the course everybody but the weather well there's a few dark clouds let's hope everything will be good today i'm going to play the best game i can at the moment still undergoing some psychiatric help and treatment etc but hey it's all part of the fun isn't it i'm with friends today hopefully you'll be there too and I'm currently sorting out cameras, tripods, etc, etc. They're all gone to the loo or in the bar. I know, this is the real behind the scenes, me. And if you're asking why was I here so early, well, I like to always be very early on these kind of shoots. Uh, again, always checking the cameras and stuff, but also I want to speak to the managers here, speak to the pros here, talk to some of the people playing. Gives me a chance to walk around part of the course just to see what it's like, especially if I've never played here before, like here at Yelverton. Um, 
just kind of, I need to relax. So I've got to get everything done before, normally before the other lads turn up. Had a comment um, this week on the channel. Typical problem you get with it, with uh, YouTube, as you're on camera. Um, I had one person, I have no idea who he is, that, uh, why have you got a golf channel when you obviously don't like golf? <laughs> okay. They don't get it, do they? They don't get it, mate. They, they don't get, don't get it. Yeah. Yeah. No. You obviously don't like playing golf, mate. Really like Strange. Yeah. <laughs> I love it, really. YouTube, love it, don't you? So we're about to start the round. So, <clears throat> obviously the first thing we have to do is the introduction. So, uh, just setting up the yeah, camera. So we're all ready to go. Yeah. We're ready to go. Get me glove on. I'd like to think we're ready to go. <laughs> John's there, uh, ready to do the introduction. Darren's going to see us off first. Yeah. So obviously, normally film it in three parts. So do an introduction and an ending on each one. So Neil, a bit more that way. Stop there. No, stop. Yep, yeah, Darren. Right, terrific. Coming a bit closer, lads, because it's going to be blowing this wind today. Lovely. Right. Hi, everybody. Welcome to another Cornish. Hang on. Welcome to another Devonshire quest. So, we're walking to hole number two, which means we've got to cross the main road, and it's a proper main road. So, Darren was saying because it's on the uh, National Park, they can't build a tunnel or anything. So. There are no buggies on this course either. Come on, lads, green cross coast. Come on. I'm glad there wasn't a footbridge because Neil wouldn't have gone off it. No, no, I wouldn't he have been up and over that. Does he? Heights, heights. Oh, heights. Yeah, yeah. You should have seen him at the open when he couldn't go over the back no. go with We had to go across the road. Yeah. yeah, we just crossed the road. I don't know why there was even a bridge there. Thank you, Steve. Right, that's obstacle one done. Yeah. One well under on the first hole. You know, I've never actually edited or put one under on the first hole before. No. Mm. Right, let's well, crack on, indeed. let's crack on. Right, first hole done now. Yep, good nice birdie. birdie. Solo birdie for you. But uh, me and you come right yep. on this one. I think I'm, uh, I'm on the road. But we always do a, a scramble on the corner to quest, don't we? Yeah, yeah. It just... It's just to showcase the course and just have a bit of fun while we're doing it. And obviously we're always conscious about other players on the course not holding anyone yeah. up. Yeah. So a scramble just makes it easier to feel from the same yeah. spot, whereas if you're playing all your own board... You're walking there, <laughs> dragging the camera everywhere. It's just so much easier, you just focus on one area and you know, where you go. But yeah, the, uh, the aim is just to showcase the course yeah. uh, and have some fun. That's it. That's the main thing. If I can see a couple of balls, it'll be all right. Yeah. Bit more behind the scenes footage. Here's Neil walking up on the third hole Hello. after taking your, uh, the photograph for the T yeah, marker yeah, for yeah. hole number three. You didn't do it for hole number two. That's the problems I've got to deal with, honestly. I know. Yeah. I know. You were too busy doing a very little arty farty bit, weren't you? Of us going over the road. I can't do everything. True. <laughs> I, I hope Steve didn't use the GoPro for his behind the scenes footage for that bit, honestly. Comfort break, eh? Literally. Third hole approach. Third hole approach. So this is one thing about the the vlogs is uh, finding your balls. Neil's hit a a cracker, but we can't find it. So frustrating. Obviously, as you well seen so far. Don't forget your photo, Neil. Yes, yeah, I went through. And Neil's got a. I've been told off once. If you're a bit wayward, even though it's genderless, you end up in the. Take the goals. Well. Done. So, 
So again, as a part of the vlog, we um, discuss the hoes before we play them. So Neil would just do an introduction to the hoe, how many yards it is. Darren sets up for the tee, um, ready for the shot traces. And then uh, we'll hit the shots. Going to scenes, I know. Golfers CBD. Uh, they are, they're one of the people that actually help our golf day, aren't they? they? They quite often donate stuff. They'll be donating to the next one, I believe. Yeah, they I'm, change what, their sweets, didn't they? Yeah. Um, I take quite a lot of these when I'm playing with this lot and thinking about the filming and thinking about all the other stuff that goes on, as well as trying to hit a ball sometimes. Thank is, you. Is that because we make you go, um, yeah, because <laughs> it made me go, um, whatever that is. <laughs> yeah. I, don't know, I don't know what he's talking about, I have no idea. See what I mean? Is it's it like having three children again, isn't like, it, John? It's like herding kittens, honestly, it is. The snack go. wars, look, see, what have you got now. This, there are other brands available. On the what? Steve, it's, oh, it's oh, kind mint. of like. Yeah, I, I, I don't do mint. You don't do mint. Don't do mint. <laughs> not not mint food. I oh. do chewing no, gum. Bring it back, Darren. No, yes. No, bring it in. You can bring it in, but don't let me touch it. Right. I'm not right. allowed, mate. You don't. My, no, my wife. My wife sees that. She'll she'll do um she'll throw up across the room, mate. What if I take it out the rack? Projectile <laughs> vomit. <laughs> um, do you not do mint, John? Well, I love mint. I actually love it. I love all the kind of, especially Christmas, all the kind of mint chocolates and stuff, as you can see. Um, but my wife is allergic to mint. Kelly is allergic oh, to God, mint. Oh, God, oh, was she? Yeah. Sorry, Kelly, I'm so, not trying to hurt you. <laughs> so, so they're banned in our house. Mints are banned. Sorry, mate. I've carried this box around and I'm not even eating them because I'm on poaching dogs. <laughs> That more ponies. Nice to see. Just a few of them. We're on the fifth fairway, I believe. We are indeed. Yep. Neil's at a cracking well. shot, which we've sat there. But there are people on the tee and they're members, so we're letting them play through. It's what we have to do. We're not here to delay people who, who pay good money to come and play. So, unfortunately, sometimes if, it, if this happens a lot, we are stuck for many, many hours. But it's the nature of what we do on YouTube. We don't want to get in the way of people. No, I don't think people realise why we're filming um, until they actually come and play. Uh, that it's a very stop-start thing that we play. Yes. And uh, especially when we're doing this kind of blogging, that yeah. you know, quite often we'll hit bad shots because we just haven't hit one for ages. Your normal rounds, what three and a half hours? Yeah. Four hours. We could take. We we could take up to eight. Yeah. Yeah. If depending on how many. If we're filming people. on four ball. Yeah, Robert that's, that's why we're doing scrambles because they're quicker. Yeah, we can get around with a scramble in about five hours normally. Yeah. Yeah. Um, if we had two or three cameras, it'd be seven hours, yeah. seven and a half at least. Um, and that's if that's on a clear run. Yeah. So, and we're walking. And yeah. we're walking as well, which again slows so it down a little bit. Time, yeah. One reason why we use buggies is because, quite frankly, it's just quicker to get between one ball and another. So, again, this is just the frustrations of maybe YouTube. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Let's just let some more members come through. Lovely people. Just going to zoom over there. Now, who was it told me that was a panda? Because that certainly doesn't look like a panda to me. <laughs> uh, I mean, all right, so it's got the same colouring, lad, but that's definitely not a panda. You're welcome, enjoy the rest of your round. Have Be a nice round. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Not Steve. Steve one beautiful. Can be. Can I, be beautiful. I, I have played a panda before. Did it win? Steve has played a panda. Yes. Well, I, in, um, I hope you mean it's something like pantomime and not you played against was, a panda. It was Hoberton Amateur Dramatics. I think <laughs> I was... But you were a panda. Eight or nine. Oh, okay. And it was Aladdin. Oh, nice. So I played... Taifu the panda. Taifu the panda. You and John Evil ought to get together because John <laughs> does a lot of amateur dramatics, I believe. <laughs> this was many years ago. I'm just very dramatic or very amateur. So we're just going to um, find out who we took. Who do we take in the end? Steve. 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 Well done. 
Yeah, mine was a bit too close to the pandas, a bit shorter. <laughs> but what happened to yours two, lads? I'd be found mine, it was just... It was How many other balls did you find? Three, so Three. I found seven now. <laughs> one for me. One for you, you found one as well, okay. Fine. Right, so just let these gentlemen uh, move on a bit more, and we'll still carry on. Two seven. Two seven. Oh, I can honestly say this is so far not Neil's hole. Are you want to divot then? <laughs> there is one now. No. There is one now. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's go and find. Uh, let's go and find someone's ball. Probably, Steve. I'm gonna have a go. Neil couldn't stand it. You had to have a go at a driver off the deck. I don't know. I can't even hit a three wood, so I doubt I'll be able to hit a driver off the deck. No. Into the lead. <laughs> One of the other reasons why it takes us such a long time is when Neil does a duff shot, he has to have another go, doesn't he? Prove himself. I wouldn't have bothered if I was him, but he can't hit a driver off deck. Nor can I. I can't even hit a driver. <laughs> Neil had gone right there, Darren's on the left here. And we were whilst we're looking for a ball. Big Oggy setting up for the next shot on Darren's. Uh, whittering away. Whittering away whilst we try and find balls. Tell me what's happening. Avoiding the ponies. Doing a ball. So, I shot at the ponies course we played. Take that one home, it's like a Dalmatian yeah. pony. Oh, Go with my dog. You still got the Dalmatian, yeah? Still got the Dalmatian. Yeah, the Dalmatian. Not the dog is. Not the dog is. <laughs> I wouldn't know about that. Well, I can tell you a few places in Devon, but probably not on. Well, I'm not here. No. Uh, uh, I'm saying no. Oh my God, he got the camera on. Oh, but like, hello. Oh, skip that. I'll yeah, turn I'll the camera on. off. I'll leave it here. I don't care. I'm this on is... medication. <laughs> Nothing matters. Yeah, you're this is... exempt of all I'm legally exempt of all responsibility <laughs> right now. This is just some of the conversations we have in between the vlogs. I've had a varied life. Everyone knows that. <laughs> So, the conversation. If you don't. You should find out. The conversation does get interesting. It, it can do, yeah. I told you. Hang on, Steve. I told you before, mate. You can't discuss my stuff on camera unless people die. I can't write a book or anything unless at least a certain amount of people die. Neil's not going to meet again, is he? Oh, yeah. Honestly, I'm waiting to see the behind the scenes video because it's far more fun so, to play the golf. Isn't it? This is uh, one of the elites. Which uh, we mentioned on the course was done by um, Sir Francis Drake. Well done. I know you said rally, but that's the other one, isn't it? That's the other one, mate. Yeah. So. He had his head cut off. He had his head cut off, yeah. <laughs> Didn't Drake? No. Oh no, rally, yeah. It ain't too bad to go. I've been noticing these four cows right in front of the yeah. green. Oh. It's true, because some people might go, oh, it don't really matter, but actually, if I couldn't, I couldn't hit towards that green now, with that lot right in front, that'd be cruel. You yeah. can't hit animals just because we're playing golf. No, no. But all, you can know, hit over them. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, people will. It's tricky, isn't it? We could take Darren's. Uh, this has got a different line, so might not hit the cows. Here, yeah? You definitely don't want to be long here. No. Definitely. You don't want to be short either with the cows. Right, 
six. Is that plain one? That's John Steve. So if you film Steve, I'll try it. It's quite windy. You got Marcy? Yeah. Yeah, we need to find out where we're going. Oh, that flashes. I like that. Yeah. 207. Long way. Still a long way, lads. Handy being magnetic, though. Very handy. Very handy. Very handy. Too close to so you look through a little circle. Yeah. Then duck, aim the circle up the flag, press the trigger. Press it once, let go. Press it once, let it go. Wow, look at that. It's a heck of a clear, isn't it? Good enough. Great, aren't they? It's light as well. I'm always uh, usually been a watch mermaid myself, yeah. so that for me is a yeah. a revelation. That is it's a revelation. I've joined the modern times, haven't it? Well, the gentlemen, we obviously took wheels, and we are one thirty nine. One thirty nine away. Right, so we weren't going to make bunkers, but that's fine. Good shot, one bad shot. How far is the wildlife, Neil? Well, the closest cow is 74 yards. Yep. Mm -hmm. 12 hole. The centre of the green here is a good Beautiful shot. hole. Twelve hole. What a lovely hole. Twelve hole. Par three, twelve hole. That was pretty good. A little bit on the right. Towards that. Horse in the... Yes, okay. Okay. There's a 12th. I'll just say before we carry on, Neil. Four, 437 yard par 4. 13th. 13th. It's a 13th, Neil, it's the start of the new video. Yes. Let's start that a little bit again. <laughs> this is the 13th hole. Yep. 437. 437 yard par 4. Okay. Darren was already set up, so we let him go. So we're on the last six. Uh, lights getting darker now so we are a bit of running and gunning now so if someone gets a good drive away that's it we'll just take it um does make a big difference doesn't it Neil walking oh it does yeah. with a buggy yeah it adds uh, adds an hour or so onto the, the vlogs really yeah. um yeah I mean we're six o'clock so we haven't got much light left yes so we have let some people go through so that's take us a bit of time but when you're having to walk to every shot yeah. well, it does right. make it uh, a bit more time walk stop everyone play and uh, think about camera angles etc so now with the the light running we'll uh, someone gets a good drive just take it that's what you do when we're playing this uh, course vlogs we want to still show the course to its best um see what we can do so was that a par that's another par another par well done another so par. we crack on to hole number 14. the end of the mile end of the mile well done oh. neil by the way is walking over to the second because he didn't get the, the uh t marker photograph walk of shame look walk of shame opr is back before it gets dark Oh, 
So yeah, it's now getting dark. Very dark. Yeah, very dark. Uh, can't really see where the boar's going. <laughs> can't even see myself in the camera. Uh, but uh, hey, if we make the end, I mean, people say on my channel a lot at the moment, why aren't you playing enough shots? I don't have time right now. This is all part of filming. Uh, it's you know, late autumn. We got about 10 minutes to finish this before it gets pitch black. Yeah, I'm I mean, the the, those drives there, we, we couldn't really see, we see where they went. Go out there and hope we find one. We saw the line they went. Yep. Neil's went left, Darren's went right, but was coming back round. The thing uh, is that when you film on the camera and people watch, they probably will see it brighter than it is. Yeah. Uh, this is literally night golf now without a light at all. This is dark. Yeah. This is proper dusk. The oh. birds have now roosted. Yep. Uh, and I've only got two and a half hours to drive home. <laughs> so no. oh, such is life for a YouTuber, yeah? Well yeah. done, everybody. Got to go right through the county, haven't you, John? Oh, yeah. But this is what making a vlog is what entails, all about. isn't it? We, no, do, you... we do it for the people who watch, we do it for you, everybody. One forty three. I'm glad that Marsley really picks up in this dark. Fantastic new feature on it. So one forty three, we're taking Darren's. Yep. And it is very dark now. <laughs> yeah, I think we got about ten minutes before it's absolutely pitch. We ain't gonna see where these go. No. Oh. Anywhere near the green will do. Once no you're in idea. The sky, you can see oh, it. Yeah. If it's over there, it ain't too bad. Come oh, a light bulb. Oh. Sorry, yeah. <laughs> your light is not going to focus so oh, Okay. So what's it doing? Slightly left. Uh. Uh. Is that seven line? Yeah, that'll be mine. Well done, lads. <laughs> I can't see what so I'll, I'll do the quick ending of uh, Steve's video. So that was a behind the scenes video, and this is literally the sort of situation it's we have to do. Behind the scenes, it's dark. It is very dark, very dark. Probably one of the most extreme videos I think we've had to finish. <laughs> this so. could be, yeah. It's like we've a been dark field, before, but not like this. <laughs> this is the Halloween special, everybody. Well done. Yeah. Thank you very much to Steve for putting a lot of filming together today. And to the lads for playing, obviously. Oh, my pleasure. Always Everyone's fun. Been, it's yeah. always fun. It Doesn't is. matter what the ghost's like. No. It's always fun. It's a good laugh. That's what it's about. Always a pleasure, never a chore. Yes. That's true. Please subscribe, everybody, because we are doing our best to get you golf wherever we can, in whatever conditions we can find. Bye, everyone. Bye. Darren? Yes, sir? You, you just put your hand in sheep poo, mate. For what? You thought it was a pound I coin, thought it didn't was you? a pound, but what's that? It's got a lion on it. I can't even tell, mate. Is, it a, is, is that it a euro? A satyr or something. <laughs> what country's got a lion? We'll, we'll tell you all later and take a photograph. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Even Darren finds money in the dark. 20 euros. Right. <laughs> <laughs>